Okay. So now we've grabbed our shotgun shells. We have our key. I'm gonna real quick combine my pistol. Oops. 150 shots is beautiful. It means I've only used like more than a magazine. A little more. Almost two magazines the entire time. Which is pretty good. Pretty good pacing. Um Okay, now we need to go up. Yeah, we need to go up. Actually, did I grab a first aid spray? No. That's what I was going to do, is I was going to go back to the herb area. Alright, this is the door that's going to fall apart if I use it too many times. I can only use it maybe three times total before it falls off. Which is fine, because I don't think I'm going to need it a whole lot. I've been playing it safe. But now this place is not safe. There's gonna be a ton of zombies here now. Great. At least I can just go the other way. Okay, grab a green herb and grab a red herb. There's three full heals here. Just so you know. I also do not like the dogs in this game, <laughs> and they do not like me. Okay. But yeah, there's three red herbs there, which are three full heals. Which is why I keep them there, because um, I don't want to, like, get too risky and waste all my free heals. And since the dog event there happened, uh, I shouldn't have to worry about that for a while. Okay! Spoke too soon. Spoke way too soon. Moving. This is what happens when you speak too soon. Richard's just there chilling. Oh, well, that's not good. The lights went out. Yep, so we've already used the shield key for everything it needs to be used for. Now it's time to fight a snake.
That's a lot of teeth. Payback time. Richard. Richard! Hello, please. Oh, it's running? Okay. Yeah, you, you better run. I'll take Richard's assault shotgun. <laughs> he won't be needing it anymore. And that's our last mask, too. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, so now we have to go to the dangerous place because we're poisoned. Uh, I do not have time for zombies. After I grab the serum, we have all four masks, so we can go back to the, uh... We can go back to the... Crypt. But priorities first, we're poisoned and <laughs> we need serum. <laughs> I'm gonna just put us in fine condition just to make sure, because I can't tell the difference between red caution and danger. <laughs> For here, you just go through here. I should probably auto equip a shotgun. Or un auto unequip the shotgun for my pistol. Uh, through here. We're going to be dealing with a lot of zombies on the way through. So let's just get prepared. It's like the uh, Sarah crew are enjoying a bit of Overwatch. But I have a bit of a goal to keep up with because I uh, missed out on the opportunity to play this yesterday, so I gotta play through it today. And what a better time to! I mean, it's really dark, it's super quiet here. Okay, let's just put the shotgun away. I'm gonna keep the auto shotgun, though. Um, and then we're also gonna grab the other... ...masks. Because we have all of them. Now. This one is the mask without a nose. Okay, now I just grab some serum. Okay. Now we're fine. Um... We're here, we need to go over there. We can come in through... No, we don't need to, because that's later. <laughs> Sorry. Ugh. Okay. 
We don't need to do that now. <sighs> okay. I don't even know how many undead I've cleaned up. I'm willing to bet maybe two. And two of those were not critical kills. So. I think it's best that I've only eliminated two. <laughs> I forgot what that snake's name is, but it's got a really silly name. Um, actually, I can check out the, the trophy list, because I have a trophy for that. I think its name is like... It's nothing like... Scary or anything, but it's like... It's called Yawn. That's what it is. Yawn is such a great name for a snake. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. one is no eyes. This one is no mouth. No, that's no eyes, nose, and mouth. I didn't stop. Hold on. There we go. Nope. Not not good enough yet. There we go. to dispatch a frenzy zombie. grab some shot shells. Beautiful. Okay, in here should be the switch. And a stone and metal object. Which we can now use to go to the second area of the game. So for now, we're done with the mansion. How's our health looking? Okay, I got pretty wrecked there. Um, what am I doing? I can just go through the courtyard.
Okay. <sighs> oh, right, you. It was worth a shot. Okay. So the stone metal object is used... Um... Do I want to go back and get my windcrest, or should I wait? I'll, I'll come back for it later. Okay. Put this in here, and it'll unlock the door to our right. And now we have access to the actual courtyard. I think it's called the garden or something. I can't remember the name. Some more shotgun shells. A first aid spray, which is important. This place is going to have a ton of supplies later down the line, too. So, get ready for that. Ooh, and a taser charge, too. They're setting me up. Pretty good. Pretty well. Okay, so we can't do a whole lot in the top floor initially, so let's start with the bottom floor. Sword pots in a toolbox, yep. There's one thing I remember from this, is that this didn't cause any issues when I did it initially. Barry? Too late, I'm already outside the forest. Yeah, this is the courtyard. Okay, I need to face this north. There we go. Okay, that should be good. The gate will open when the guard's dog desires are fulfilled. Oh. I guess I didn't turn that the right way. Here. If they're facing north, then I need to face them west. Right? Yeah, I need to face them that way. Yeah, this is a timing one. Okay. Damn it. I got tripped. Yeah, I'll come back here when I get to the item box. Oops. I didn't mean to piss off the crows.
How's my health looking? I'll take an herb, just in case. Yeah, the item box here is kind of important because I can grab the wind crest, which will give me whatever items in the graves. Because you get the magnum there as Chris. But I don't know what you get as um I don't know what you get as Jill. This firewood looks fresh. Oop. That's a map of the man. That's a map of the courtyard. Yeah, there's a typewriter here and an item box just back here. So we're going to grab our wind crest. And we're also going to save here. Daddy attacked first, mom attacked second, inside red and slimy, white and hard. Not through mom wear. Well, okay. Okay. Yeah, we need the square crank. The best bet is to just wait here because there's more movement to room, more room to move in. <sighs> she hit hard. Okay. Nope, not the right way. Other way. Leaving immediately. She put us in red caution, which is very bad. Okay, we got the square crank, so we got all of that we need here. And we also have our wind crest, which is important. Uh. Off. Thank you. Okay, we're still in good condition. I mean, we're not in a terrible condition, but we're not perfect. So I mean, just somewhere in between. We're okay. take my time near these crows just so that I don't piss them off. Just stay on the dirt path. You'll be fine. Okay. 
Now you put the wind crest in here. And then I'll give you three crests. Sun, moon, and star. Now it's worth noting that these also have symbols behind them. So you need to protrude these first. There's a magnum. A silver serpent. Yeah, so now that we have ourselves a magnum, we should be able to deal with some situations a little bit better than usual. Okay, now let's bug out of here. Okay, now we can go to the upper part of the courtyard now that we have the square crank. This is Brad. If you can hear me, just give me a sign. Anything. Jill to Brad, can you hear me? Broken. No nope, dogs. Just avoid. Avoid. Okay, don't avoid. Run. Run, 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 run. Go upstairs. Go upstairs. Avoid killer dogs. Can't even go down the other way anyways. Go. We're a shaped hole here. Well, having graduated from second grade, I can understand that a square hole will fit a square peg. Kinda sad that the resolution of these haven't changed since the GameCube release. So like even though this is like all fancy and like high quality and everything. It's... the pre-rendered stuff is still in, like, 480p and just upscaled. Or up actually, so it just looks really ugly and hard to see. Okay, so this is the only elevator that works. We're just gonna take this down. Okay, so now we have some blue herbs. These are the antidotes. And just don't worry about the herbs. You can only go this way anyways. For now. Okay, there's a red herb. I'll take that for now. 
because you never know. So what's my condition right now? Red caution? Okay, I'll keep an eye out for later, just in case. Okay, those are some venomous snakes. There's a lot of venomous snakes. <laughs> And here we are, in the next part of the court, uh, courtyard. I know words. Okay. This is the residence. And believe it or not, this is actually, like, the safest part of the entire game. And don't have to worry about a lot of threats here. It is extremely safe. Like, see? Look, it gives a bunch of stuff to prepare. Some first aid sprays, some ink ribbons. A place to put this magnum revolver for now. And these shotgun shells. I'm actually gonna put this magnum revolver a bit lower. <clears throat> and a first aid spray. I can't remember if I need my lighter here. I'm gonna bring it just in case. But yeah, the first aid spray here is free. But because there's an ink ribbon here and a typewriter, I'm gonna save here, and I'm just gonna save the the first aid sprays. Because I can hope for a green herb in this location. Oops. No. Alright, thank you. So before we do anything, let's set up the box. Because the, we need to put it in a very specific location to prepare for when we need to transfer over. And just putting it in the middle won't help us at all. Because if you... See, there's a lot of floorboards that are just cracked and destroyed. If we go past it, we're going to be grabbed and injured um, as we go through every time. But if we just cross over this box here, we'll be fine. But our first priority is to go through this door, because it is the nearest one to the safe house. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Yep, everything's fine. Don't have to worry about giant killer spiders or anything. <laughs> Okay. Now I think... the a pencil. There it is. Okay. So... That is four. Four lines on red. I'm writing this down for later, just for reference. Oop, hello. Yeah, so giant killer spiders. Don't, don't worry about it. Nothing weird here. Grab ourselves some shoddy shells. The red book. Gonna open this up. Inside is green and blue, so that is antidote with heal. Now this is why I brought the lighter with me, is because these are kind of important. So, I'm writing down lines for these, uh, 
for the spots on the eyes that you see, like the ones on the left and right of the eye, uh, the eyelids as they're drawn, is how I'm writing it down. I don't need to write with like the iris piece because I'm following the lines here. So two lines is green. And I think the last one should be orange. Okay, and the last one is... Um... Two above. Orange. Now this is important for the other thing, which is this. You have red and orange and green there. So we want three, five, six. Or three, six, five. Three, six, five, because that is green. That is green, orange, and red's color, or green, orange, and red's billiard number. And we'll use this for later, because that actually has some importance later. And just for safety, I'm actually going to use my herb in case I need an extra spot. Um, but yeah, that's all we need to do here. So I listed four lines, two lines, and two above, because that's the placement of the uh, lines for the eye, for the eyelashes, we'll call them. Now we're going to apply these in a moment. We'll now see we have a stair, to stair set over the weak floorboards. Again, very important. I'm going to turn up the volume on my end because uh, I can't hear over the sound of uh, the dryer. Okay, so we have a locked door here. Door plate re reads gallery, yeah. Um, first thing I'm going to note is that we shouldn't take this map here because of a very specific reason. Jill. Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You all right? What's gotten into you? I'm getting you worried, aren't I? But don't, I'm all right. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. Don't worry, I'm just going to get some fresh air. If I'm lucky, I'll get to waste some monsters along the way. He's always a step ahead.
Let's push this this way. I should probably follow Barry, but uh, I'm not going to. Yes, this is, this is where things start to get a little interesting. Welcome to Aqua, Aqua Ring 1. So first things first, let's go ahead and push some blocks are this way. is still unnerving even to this day. Such a subtle tune as well. Weird thing is is that I could probably go to sleep to this. And I don't think anyone would matter for the moment. I don't think anything else would matter. Should be the last box, and then we have a clean path. Oh, right. I forgot. <laughs> Sharks! Okay, we gotta go into that middle area. And without dying. Okay, I gotta go this way? No, the other way. Other door, other door. That's not good. Am I not supposed to be here yet? Thought I had it. Thought I had the stuff ready. Guess I'm not ready for here yet. Although now that I mentioned, although now that it's worth noting, it it's kind of weird how much higher the uh... that's not good. I'd really get out of here as soon as possible. Yep, that sounds like a good idea. Okay, going, leaving, we're leaving. Everybody, everybody out. I almost just got pasted across the wall. I'm gonna take this herb while I still have the chance to. Block from the other side. Or 
don't think there's a whole lot else I can do here for now. Oh. It's worth a try. Okay. There's another door here. Yes, this is the key that I needed. This goes to room number 001. Oops. Okay. This floor is also partially flooded. I should save this green-blue combo for later, just in case. Okay, that was 002. I'm gonna go back to the safe room for now. Because I think the 001 room is back there anyways. Yeah, that should be double at one right there. And I can also put this... I, I'm gonna keep this red book because I think I need it later, too. I don't think I need my shotgun right now. Better safe than sorry as well with the first aid. I have a stockpile, and I can easily get more. Yep, discard the key, and in we go. It should get us into the other room, so... <sighs> yeah, we weren't quite ready for the, uh, the, the shark room. Check what's in this room first before I go. This goes down in this key is used for the aqua ring. Did I see someone on the floor? No. Oops. Well, that guy's gonna come back. The self-defense gun. Oh, he's not dead. Okay. He wasted a decent amount of health. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, this way. <laughs> Jeez. There's one bullet in the self-defense gun, even though it's chambered for two rounds. Self-defense or suicide. Depends on what you want to call it. By the way, we don't really have a use for this self-defense gun. <laughs> Ok, 
Okay, I don't think we need the lighter for now. Okay. Well, we now have everything we need for the control room down there. should be more lenient towards using my daggers. It's called the catfish? Really? Hold on. The catfish taser. When you really don't care about fishing, just stick it in the water and watch all the fish come up for you. <laughs> They'll never expect it. Okay, which is the shortest way? Mm, there is no shortest way. Just go this way. I also only have a pistol on me. Oh, this is gonna suck. Get up the stairs. I am in dangerous territory of health. No further use discard, yes. <laughs> Fuck. Horrible, horrible. I'll take, I'll take double green. Damn it, I don't wanna... Thank you. Okay. That's good. Good, good, good. Okay, let's read these monitors. Controls for the main system. Everything seems to be in proper working order. A pressure shelter. An error message is being displayed. Something appears to have gone wrong in the water. There's a switch to drain the water. Press it. Up. Oh. Emergency. Emergency. Unknown source of pressure detected. Blocking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Switch number one. Uh, Activate emergency drainage system immediately. Sure, okay. Release the lever. Okay. 
Okay. We're good. We're good. Everything's good. Now drain the water. The water has been completely drained. Thank goodness. shells. Um, let's go this way. Let's just get rid of this situation right now. Don't think we have to worry about that shark anymore. Residence key for the gallery. Thank heavens. 